Dell Dust and Furnish, the last shelf of my new shelving unit, the furniture, animals and accessories. So first I need to find all the accessories from the toy shop to do with I open the picture with all the contents of the set. Having laid out everything that was already in the shop, I realized that a sticker had peeled off on one of the cubes. So now I'll put it in order. Like this, I have with two containers for we will look for everything we need. I found everything except for a couple of things such as a plush elephant and a bear and I'll show you how all this will look in our shop. Well, I think our shop looks pretty nice. Later I'll add figurines to it and I hope I'll find plush toys. And the next building is supermarket on which the toy shop will actually stand. Here the situation is worse. Everything is scattered and uh, and this plastic container which I pasted the inscription ice cream for our many boxes. I opened the picture with all the contents and now I'll try to find everything. But first let's deal with the sticker. <laughs> I think it looks good. I just divided it into groups of accessories I found in the supermarket building to make it easier to understand what is missing. And now I'll put everything I need behind the scenes and show the final result. I have already furnished our supermarket, found everything but the zucchini and the grocery bag in the sweet store, in the dress shop and in the rear canal board everything is in order and nothing needs to be looked for true for a couple of shortcomings so here we need to stick a sticker again <laughs> What about the trash shop? I've had it for a long time. I got it when I was in elementary school and I wasn't a big fan of Sylvain and Family's fan. So we have what we have <laughs> for a lot of lost details here and I think the option to leave all the handmade 
dresses here is optimal. And for some reason, Webship has a big problem with stickers. I bought with a few months ago and we're already peeling off. Let's fix it. <laughs> And the last building on our shelf is Rainbow Nursery. Looking ahead, I'll say that there's nothing to correct here because I bought this used set and there was only a building without any accessories. In general, I have three Rainbow Nurseries. If you are interested, write in the comments and I'll make a separate video where I'll explain why I have three identical nurseries. Now I just have to add figurines. Completely put our shelving unit in order. At this point, I suspend a series of videos about my no longer new shelving unit. I hope you enjoy it. Please share the video with your friends if it's not difficult. Love you all! Bye!